insult and criticized by Forrest Green chairman over Christian Deutsch deal. Forrest Green Rovers chairman Dale Vince has launched a scathing attack on Bolton over the deal that took Christian Deutsch to Lancashire. Rovers star striker Deutsch moved to Sky Bat Championship side Bolton on loan in August with a view to making the move permanent. But Vince has accused Bolton chairman Ken Anderson of making promises the club could not keep in relation to the deal and claimed that Rovers have been paying Deutsch's wages for the past four months. From Monday morning, Christian Deutsch is back with FGR, Forest Green Rovers. We've taken the decision to recall him after his loan agreement expired last week mid continual contractual breaches by Bolton Wanderers, Vince wrote on his personal Facebook page. It became clear to us that Bolton entered into a contract to loan and then buy Christian last August without the means to honor it, and perhaps the intention to do so as well. They haven't even paid his wages for the last four months. We have. It's not just FGR that have been let down badly by Bolton, but Christian too. Bolton's chairman, Ken Anderson, made a lot of promises on the last day of the transfer window, both to Christian and FGR, and has kept none of them. This is all his work and from talking to Ken he feels immune from the consequences, but some of these promises are written in legally binding contracts, and will be pursuing them. When the dust settles. We'll talk to the EFL about how they regulate clubs like Bolton. They already regulate the club to a degree, controlling all TV monies to make sure that football debts get paid. Hard not to wonder whether the league could also have a role in approving the terms of any contracts entered into, to make sure that they are actually within the means of the club. We had no way to know, but the EFL should have the inside view on that. And finally, for now, Disappointing as it is to see this go pear-shaped, both for FGR and Christian, I'm also excited by the prospect of the second half of the season with Christian back with us. I'm sure all FGR fans everywhere will join me in welcoming him back. Sky Sports News have contacted Bolden for comment but they are yet to respond.